Hey everyone, it's Triple Mango Threat. Today we're going over a $20 budget commander deck. With the commander being Gallia of the Endless Dance. This is a satyr tribal deck with a sub theme of discarding. Now before you click away from this video because I said satyr tribal, give me a chance to explain. This was a suggestion in one of the comments and I was curious how to make satyr tribal work on a budget. Starting with our commander, we have Gallia of the Endless Dance, and she only costs a red and green mana. She is a 2-2 satyr, and she has haste. She also has other satyrs you control get plus one, plus one, and have haste. Whenever you attack with three or more creatures, you may discard a card at random. If you do, draw two cards. Now already you can see it suggests satyr tribal by giving you that plus one, plus one to your creatures. But more importantly, we get to draw cards by attacking. Let's get into the other cards in the deck that support this commander. We're going to need cards that help us ramp, such as Fertile Ground, Omen of the Hunt, Rampant Growth, and Wild Growth. Mana Rocks will also help us in the mana producing section with cards like Gruel Clue Stone, Gruel Key Rune, Gruel Locket, and Heraldic Banner. Now besides our commander helping us draw, we have Faithless Looting, Shamanic Revelation, and Thrill of Possibility. When it comes to Faithless Looting and Thrill of Possibility, it gives us another way to discard cards. This is really going to help us with our sub-theme of discarding. And when we need to take care of our opponent's cards, we have removal such as Ancient Grudge, Destructive Revelry, Naturalize, and Return to Nature. The main theme of the deck is Seder Tribal, so let's talk about that. Most of the Seder cards are going to cost us about 2 mana, and will be 2-2 creatures. We have Careless Celebrant, Heroes of the Revel, Irreverent Revelers, Nexus Wardens. When we attack with three or more creatures, we can discard a card at random to draw two. So to help us attack more and with big threats, we have Cleaver Riot, Ferocity of the Wilds, Goblin Aura Flame, and Overrun. Giving our creatures trample after all of the plus one buffs will be a great way to finish off our opponents. After we attack, we have the option to discard cards. The sub-theme of the deck is discarding. So as for discarding, we have Bag of Holding, Glinthorn Buccaneer, Reckless Worm, and Stromkirk Oculist. Bag of Holding will help us return the discarded cards to our hand, which we already benefit from because we draw two cards thanks to our commander. Glinthorn Buccaneer encourages us to discard, and we get to deal our opponents one damage each time by attacking them, and we get to draw cards. Cards like Reckless Worm and Stromkirk Oculist have madness, which allows us to pay a cheaper cost when we discard those cards. So to summarize the deck, we want to cast our cheap CMC creatures, attack with them, discard cards at random, draw two cards, then make our opponents cry all for $20. Hey, you made it to the end of the video. If you like this video, you can leave a thumbs up. If you think I missed a card or you want to make a suggestion for the next deck tech, comment below. If you want to see more of this mango content, you can subscribe to see when I post a new video. If you want to purchase the whole deck or just a few cards from the deck, you can do so with the TCG link in the description. If you want to buy any of the mango family merch, you can also do so in the description below. Thank you so much for your continued support. I'll see you in the next one. Uh, peace.